I'm Tim Carter from AskTheBuilder.com, and we're getting ready to pour the concrete slab. The truck's here. Check this out. What's really nice about these front uh, loader trucks is that the driver is in the cab right there and he can see exactly what the two finishers are getting ready to do and by him moving the chute back and forth uh, he can make their work a whole lot easier. So watch this. Here comes the concrete. And notice what they're doing. They're using the hooks on the end of the come-alongs to pull that mesh and get it up into the middle of the concrete. Look how fluid that concrete is. It's almost flowing on its own. You can see how you can use these concrete rakes to just pull that concrete. And once the right consistency, it just flows. Look at that. They sometimes call the come-alongs concrete rakes because it just looks, looks, looks just like a regular rake, a leaf rake. It just pulls the material. And of course, they're... Now, what's really important to note is that the concrete driver has stopped the flow of the concrete down the chute and, while well, he lets them in work and, and place this concrete in the corner. And... Uh, it's just a real controlled worksite, no problems, and uh, it's really kind of that easy. Don't let the concrete truck driver get in front of you. You know, let let you know, tell him to stop the concrete coming down the chute if you have to. I'm Tim Carter for AskTheBuilder.com. We'll be back with more about pouring the concrete slab in just a moment. If you want to discover more home improvement tips, go to AskTheBuilder.com.